John Wiener. And in Italy, I was a production manager. And now that we're back home, I'm one of the editors for the doc. The most challenging part was probably getting everyone to get their equipment together every day. Jess and I had to like organize all the bags every day to see like who was taking what where. When you're going through the footage as an editor, a lot of times I go, I remember seeing this when we first filmed it that day. Not, not everyone can edit. A lot of people can, but not everybody. My favorite memory was at the Chestnut Festival in Monteroduni. Some of us were working, but a lot of us weren't, and we were sort of just like enjoying the festival and like drinking all the homemade wine. And I thought that was a really good time, good bonding time for the class. A lot of fun memories were made, I think. That was definitely my favorite memory. There were two residents in particular, Javid and Riaz, who were from Pakistan. I think my favorite memory with them was one day we were uh, playing football and it was just me, them and Adam like throwing the football around and then a couple of the other migrants who I don't think like normally hung out with the Pakistanis came over and they started throwing the football around with us. Got to a point where me and Adam sort of backed off and just watched and it was kind of cool to see like these different cultures that I don't think normally would come together, coming together. Immigration is one of those things that kind of has always been happening and it's happened in America all the time. Like if you think just like early 1900s when like Italian and Irish immigrants were coming over, America had a big problem with it. Now Irish and Italian people are like just everyday people in our cultures. In Italy at some point, they'll reach a point in time where they're like, oh wow, that was pretty ridiculous, like us overreacting about that whole issue back then. Obviously it's like a slow process, so I don't think you realize it while it's happening, but once it's all said and done, I think we're all gonna look back on it and be like, oh, that was pretty crazy. I will say to this to you, the Italian people, I'm hoping in like 40 or 50 years we look back on this and it's like, oh, we solved it. That was kind of, that documentary, that was so out of date. Everyone's great. I love cross-current pictures with all my heart.